I'm Ashley Esteba, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today, I'm going to show you how to turn location services off on your iPhone. Now, this will only work for iPhone 3GS and newer, so if you have an iPhone 3G or a regular iPhone, this isn't going to apply to you because there's no GPS chip installed in those phones. Well, we have an iPhone 4, so we're going to shut off location services. Now, sometimes you want a little bit more privacy in terms of your apps or what your phone is telling Apple about where you are and what you're doing. And that's where location services come in. So what we're going to do is we are going to unlock our iPhone and we are going to go into settings and we are going to go to general. It looks like little gears. So once we tap on that and you'll see a whole bunch of different options network, Bluetooth, and location services is in the second section. It's the third one down. Now at this point, you can do one of two things. You can completely shut off location services, which is the very first option, or you can actually shut off location services based on an app. So for example, camera is turned on. That means that if I take a picture, that picture's data has my location in it. So it will put latitude and longitude of where exactly I took that picture. Some people really love that feature and some people really don't like that feature. So, and compass is also the same thing. So you can turn location services on or off depending on which app you want, but for right now, we're gonna just shut off location services entirely. So all we have to do is we go to location services and we just toggle it off. And now you can see that nothing is using location services on your iPhone because everything is blank. So we can go ahead and hit the home button and that is how to shut off location services on your iPhone. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content and we'll see you next time.